Hi, this is Bob Leahy, and we're talking with Stephen Lincoln. Steve is the uh, brain cowboy, and we'll talk about that in a minute from Positive Lights. Uh, welcome to Positive Lights, Steve. Thank you, Bob. Yeah, now, we're sitting, where are we today? Tell me where we are. Uh, we are just south of Cothra Park on Church Street, across from the beer store where we still actually have our free advertisement on the HIV stigma That's campaign right. mural. And I was going to ask you that. Now, we've known each other for a while, right? Several years, How ha and And funny enough, it's also been in a sort of blogging uh, capacity. Tell me about how we sort of got to know each other. Actually, you and I met first at, al at the alumni event for the OAN leadership. Uh, and we started talking primarily because somebody pointed you out as a Peterborough-based boy. I approached you. We started talking about Parn. And the blogging came later. So and the blogging actually, was... We were introduced actually yes. well in advance of the yes. campaign. And you've actually helped me a lot with my, my previous blogging career, haven't you? I... Sort of. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, well, sure, yeah, yeah okay. But, uh, but uh, then that's through the HIV Stigma campaign, yes, right? Absolutely. Where, we, absolutely. where I was a blogger there and you were... Uh, what was your official title there? I was the Online Facilitator Support Coordinator. Essentially the mother hen. For, mother hen. For the bloggers on that yes. site. And now you're blogging. Um, have you blogged before, Steve? I have not. Well, I, I've blogged in the capacity uh, of some academic things for, for my students. Not really blogging, but sort of making, mm. providing posts on course materials and commentary, things like that. Okay, and and what, what is your, your blog is called Urbane Cowboy, which I think is a rather cool, cool idea, because you're a bit of a cowboy, um, and a bit, bit urbane, and, uh, but tell me what, what you want to cover in the blog. Okay. What sort of subject matter have so, you got in mind? Are we going to the essence of my name or uh, what, the, what, what you want to write about? What was you, if you had free reign, what would you write about? Okay, actually stems then from my moniker to an extent. I'm I chose cowboy because of my sort of small town background which I think I made clear in the introductory part of the blog itself. Urbane as a way to poke fun at myself primarily such that I am obsessed with detail and polishing things as I point out in my blog or the intro and, to and a And I've, I've been known to, to pull your leg about that. Absolutely. I, I sometimes uh, we, we have a thing going about big words, I think. So big words. You like you big know, words, right? The fun, the irony, here we go, is that the words I don't consider big words are considered big by others and mm -hmm. I've learned that lesson. Yeah. So you're going to do this without, with flying without a net, without an editor, you're just going to put whatever comes into your head. But I am going to use my vocabulary because I can't escape it all this, entirely. This is cool. Um, okay, now, now I'm, I always ask uh, bloggers, I mean, uh, you know, we want to know a bit more, more about Steve, because many people know you through the OEN. Right. Um, you're a little bit m more mysterious, uh, you know, the real Steve Lincoln. Now tell me, would you describe yourself as a bear? Are you, do, you, do you hang around with other bears? Or where, where do you fit into the gay scene? Interesting question. Even, it was this morning or yesterday afternoon, somebody described me as a partial bear, and I really did not self-identify. Which, which part of you is way. a bear? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I know that some people see me this way. Mm -hmm. I have this very sort of odd conception of what a bear is anyway, so... Mm -hmm. But do you uh, hang around other bears? Do you go no, to bear bars? No, not at all. Bear, bear, bear I was going to say bear backing, but we won't go there. But bear, bear websites? Uh, no, no. no. In okay. fact, I was actually told about my first bear website, which is bear411 by someone who is a self-proclaimed bear who yeah. said, check it out, I'm on there. So. Okay. So tell me something about you that nobody probably knows from the OAN or anywhere. anywhere. So, some, some little nugget that, some uh, that it doesn't have to be embarrassing. Just a, pe uh, a piece of information. A piece that, of information mm, about myself. That nobody knows. That no one knows. Mm. That, that would be that, that titillating. Is, that is an on-the-spot question. Yes. I was married. You were married? I to a man. Know that. To a man. For a very brief period of time. Now, where was this? Here. But it didn't work out. No one knows this. It didn't work out primarily because the HIV became a very complicated uh, factor in our mm -hmm. intimacy. Yeah. Okay. So that actually, is a, no that, one knows that. That except is a good my nugget. That is a good nugget. But now everybody will know that. You know that. True. Yeah. That's the thing about and that's, blogging. I, I have no problem with that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, a couple of more more, more searching questions. Um, uh, do you watch American Idol? Uh, 
If it happens to be on, yes. Delete. If it hap... No, I watched it last night because I find the gym teacher rather intriguing, if yes. not humorous. And what, 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 what do you watch? What, what is your favorite? You're going to be... Thing? You're going to be surprised. Go for I it. am a news junkie and I watch Jeopardy. You are uh, not not uh, Wheel of Fortune before that. Oh no, no. Uh, you see, I watch Judge Judy. <laughs> oh, oh Judge much, Judy. But I, I, I uh, hate. Uh, okay. I, I was hesitant to mention this because I, I just I know the chagrin you hold for that woman. She is awful. <laughs> but I, but see, this is much like why I watch Fox News. I like mm. to know why the people I dislike think the way they do, yeah. although they are, don't always fully disclose it. Steve Rankin, you're an interesting man. We'll get to know you more on Positive Light. Thank you for talking to us. Thank you, Bob. And thanks, everybody, for uh, giving me the shot to do this. I appreciate it. Stay tuned. All right.